And now, KernCast 23. Well, good morning, everyone. After quite the messy weekend, it looks like we are starting to taper off a little bit with those storms for this morning. The valley looks to be clear for the remainder of the day and setting up to have a beautiful weekend store. But unfortunately for the mountain communities, we do have a little bit of the lingering stuff. And then by later on this morning, you will be just fine. and You'll be shaping up to have a nice afternoon just like us here on the valley floor. Up in the Tatchby Valley, you can see from our city of Tatchby camera that we do have some beautiful lights there in the background, which is a good thing. Our camera is not obscured here. We do have just a slight breeze up there as the last of everything moves on through. And like I mentioned, just a slight chance for some snow up there. We do have some closed schools and some closed roads, unfortunately, because of this mess. But Mike and Crystal will have those details for you in just a minute. First, I need to explain why this is happening. It was a cool day yesterday. We only got up to 55 degrees with that storm here in Bakersfield. Our average is about 69. We look to be closer to that average tomorrow and then surpassing it as high pressure builds in this week. Right now, we're currently at 41 degrees. Our overnight low has been at 40, so we're warming up nicely as we set up for the day. Our dew point at 37, but we're not talking about any fog today after getting more than a tenth of an inch of rain here in Bakersfield. And there is a calm wind, again, just slightly kicking up back and forth as it pushes those clouds out of the way. As you can see, a lot of cloud California still has some cloud cover. Just a little bit of rain offshore to the north. You can see some of the lingering stuff here in our mountains, but then that's also tapering off. If you're heading down south, San Diego sees a little bit of rain this morning, and then they'll also have some clear as well. So as you can see from our radar, we did have some snow overnight, but now everything is clearing out of the mountains, so you're shaping up to have a nice day. In Tatchby, you kids get to play in the snow today. Some school districts up there are closed. As we head into the week, though, I mentioned those warming temperatures. You can see that ridge of high pressure building that will come on shore, bringing us nothing but sunshine for majority of the week. But then this ridge will start to break down on Friday, making room for some cloud cover this weekend and a cool down as we talk about our next chance for a storm. Unfortunately, we're not quite sure what the models are doing just yet because they can't quite come into agreement. One is bringing the storm right down the coast and keeping it offshore, meaning no rain. Another one does bring it onshore, bringing us some more rain, which is nice because we can always take whatever we can get, especially after such a dry winter and today is the last day of winter later tonight about 11 o'clock 11 30 spring will officially begin as we head into tomorrow our air quality in the good range today at 39 thanks to all that fresh air we got off the ocean your allergies though still pretty high 8.2 out of 12 there with new predominant pollens of oak and sweet gum now jumping in if you're traveling up north, expect mostly clear skies into Fresno, but still some cloud cover up north, just 35 into Yosemite. Down along the central coast, 50s with some breezy conditions there, mostly clear skies. And into Southern California, I mentioned the rain in San Diego. Then that'll clear out of the way. They're talking 56 there, lower 60s for everyone else. So here we are back at home. Again, a cool day for us, partly cloudy skies lingering mid to upper 50s throughout the valley floor. Up in the mountains, another cool day there, only in the 40s for the Kern River Valley, just 39 for Tatchby. And out to eastern Kern County, mostly clear skies there, and Ridgecrest warming all the way up to 60, where everyone else sees those 50s. Now there we go, pleasant temperatures on the way, you guys, from Wednesday all the way through Saturday. And then Sunday, there's our slight chance of rain with the cool down and the cloud cover returning. In the Kern River Valley, look at this jump, 48 degrees today, a 10 degree jump to the 50s tomorrow, and then suddenly 70s for you also Wednesday through Friday. And into the mountains, only 39 for you to hatch me today, but 49 tomorrow, and then 60s for the middle of the week. And we mentioned the hail, that was thanks to those mild warm temperatures we had. The sun was able to break through those clouds, toss that rain straight back up to the clouds. Mm -hmm. It froze and then collapsed and fell. So quite a strange event, but again, it's done. And today just looks to be nice and boring. <laughs> we'll take okay. it nice and boring. Yeah. <laughs> Brings say, fewer problems. We'll yeah. take right, it. Take Thanks a look at it.